Today in the Daily Dose, a heartbeat in the earth. Known for his later work in plate tectonics, in 1961, geologist Jack Oliver detected a steady pulse in the earth, known by seismologists as a microseism, which repeated itself every 26 seconds without fail, much like the beating of the human heart. He also figured out that the heartbeat was coming from somewhere in the southern or equatorial Atlantic Ocean, which grew substantially stronger during the southern hemisphere's winter months. In 1980, geologist Gary Holcomb added to the mystery when he discovered that the Earth's heartbeat grew stronger during storms, while in 2005, using much more advanced seismographic equipment than Oliver's earlier paper tracings, Greg Benson triangulated the pulse's location to a single source in the Gulf of Guinea, off the western coast of Africa. While seismic events and noises emitting from the Earth are a daily and quite common occurrence, caused by geologic, volcanic, meteorologic, and human activity, even a Taylor Swift concert, the regularity of the pulse emitting from the Gulf of Guinea has caused much debate among geologists regarding its causal origins. One camp points to ocean currents and waves caused by the sun, pointing to the fact that the sun heats the earth more intensely at the equator than it does at the poles, which generates storms, winds, and ocean currents. And when those currents transfer their energy against continental shelves or a solid landmass, they vibrate their energy in the form of seismic noise resulting in pulses of consistent repeatability. Adding to the debate, in 2013, postdoc student Gary Uller of Washington University in St. Louis narrowed the source of the pulse to a location in the Gulf of Guinea known as the Bight of Bonnie, which is suspiciously close to a dormant volcano on the island of Sao Tome, igniting a second origin theory posed by a team led by Yinjia Shia from the Institute of Geodesy and Geophysics in Wuhan, China. Pointing to the Sao Tome volcano as the source, the group cited the Aso volcano in Japan, which also emits a similar yet weaker repeatable microseism. While no consensus yet exists among geologists, seismologists, oceanographers, and volcanologists, the steady pulse emitting from the Bight of Bonnie stands as a vivid example of phenomena we've yet to understand about our planet and the cosmos, making Earth's pulsating heartbeat a work in progress in the ongoing march of scientific discovery. And there you have it, a heartbeat in the Earth, today on The Daily Dose. If you like learning something new every day, subscribe to The Daily Dose on YouTube or sign up for emails at dailydosenow.com.